Hello everyone, Romy here, and welcome to another episode of The Sims for 30 Day Create a Sim Challenge. Today is day 5, and we are going to be creating a gothic sim. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, when I think gothic, I think black. So we're going to go right in and get her some dark hair. Ah. There's kind of a cool hair, so let's do this one. Do we have some cool colors? That says blue, but I don't think that's blue. Purple, teal, red. Okay, so we'll leave, we'll, do, we'll let it be red. Uh, let's go in and change the eyebrows. Um, we'll take off her makeup. And I do want to change the eyes just because I do not like the eyes with the eyelashes. Eyebrows. Where's the ones that have little cuts in them? This is the left eyebrow. We'll have this one. Oh, let's go ahead and grab our eyelashes first. Eyelashes. Let's look for piercings. That is a lot of piercings. Okay, does that look like it fits? That looks like it fits. Yeah, you can't adjust the earrings, so you have to kind of just make the ears fit the earring style. So we'll go ahead and give her those. Um, let's see what else we've got here as far as accessories. I don't know how eyebrow piercings work or fit. No, not that one. Because we want it on the left side so we can see it. Yeah, I always feel like these are way too low. They don't fit properly. It kind of makes me wonder, like, how did they decide where this was going to go on the sim? Because when I move the sim, like, it just moves everything with her. Okay, so... Not that piercing. I mean, she's already got the kind of cool bladed eyebrow, so maybe just... There's a nose ring. Put that on the right side. I want the eyebrow thing off. There. Okay, I forgot to do skin tone. But I know I wanted her to be pale. There, that works. Take off the tattoos. The only way tattoos will work is if they are custom mm -hmm. tattoos, I believe. No, even then they're not showing up. Well, that one works. Oh well. Go back up here to makeup and such. Accessories. Let's see if we can find a necklace. Maybe some kind of choker. Alright, let's see. Hmm. Hmm, indeed. That was kind of neat. Ah. Okay, so we use that one. And now let's, oh god, we haven't done our makeup. We need makeup. I feel like makeup really is one of the essential things in a gothic look. You have to have makeup to look goth. And of course, the regular in-game makeups are not going to work because we have the custom content on. All right, eyes. We want it bigger than that. Let's see what we got for eyeliners. Cheeks. We need. Mm -hmm. Let's do lips. I'm not gonna do whatever she's got on her cheeks is fine. We'll do lips. We want a dark lip. I feel like her lips are kind of high. Is that a little better? A black lip. Sure. Okay. Now let's go to her clothing. Oh, that's mm. kind of interesting. We know your order. <laughs> That's funny. Some pizza Illuminati. Hex your ex. McGoth. Aw, kitty. Go to hell. Okay. So we want something a little lower cut so that it'll show off the choker that we're wearing. A goth doll. That's cute. I like the goth doll shirt. So let's see what we can do as far as pants or bottoms. Now I know I have some cute... Um, like a cute skirt, but I also downloaded some extra things today, um, because I had tried to start this challenge once before, and I didn't have anything that I felt really looked gothic, or, you know, what I believed my idea of a goth type look would be, so I went to the Sims resource, and I downloaded some things that I thought might help. Oh, you can see her skirt or her underwear under there under there 
Now, I do like these jeans. I wonder if we can find something that will go underneath them. No, those definitely don't go underneath. Those don't go underneath either. We want under. 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 Well, that is frustrating. But I know we can do these rings and these. Boom. Okay. Um, I really think I want a skirt. If I can't do something underneath that, I want a skirt. And I know the skirt I want. I just have to find it. Where's our skirt? Here it is. Boom. We don't want that, though. We want black. Nice. Okay, so now we'll see if we can find some kind of leggings. No. No kitties. Sorry. Those are these ripped up ones. Shoes. We want some kind of boots. I know of some that I like. Those are cute. I really like these ones. I feel like she needs some more jewelry, like uh, bracelets or something. Oh, we could give her a purse. That'll work. Do we want bracelets? Ah. One of those. That's cute. Okay, so we'll do a leather band on one side and some spikes on the other. So I think that looks cool. Okay, so we could call ah. this look done. Let's give her a name. Um, Carver. <laughs> Carver is a cool last name. Beatrice Carver. That works. I kind of like Carver. <laughs> um, so let's see. For I like to try and pick things that kind of go along with what we're we're doing here for our ah. our uh, hmm. our theme. So let's see. We can make her a city sim. What do we think when we think of gothic? Maybe make her a loner. Maybe make her a little bit of a snob. Uh. And that's not, I don't think it's going to make her stuck up. I think it's going to make her um, just really like nicer things and just not be impressed by like cheap things. I wonder if there are just black things. We could do it on her to be a slob. Make her a geek. Oh. <laughs> That'll work. Beatrice Carver. So we will call her finished. Yeah, I like her. Alright, there is our gothic sim. Thank you very much for watching. I appreciate it so, so much. Um, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Um, and I will see you in uh -huh. the next episode of The Sims 4 30 Day Create a Sim Challenge. Bye-bye.